Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. We're going to be unboxing some of the items that I picked up um, sometime last week. I picked up these throughout the week and the weekend. So I want to show those to you. I picked up a lot more, uh, a lot of pops as well. Um, check out my Instagram. Link in the description below if you want to see what else I picked up. Um, we're going to start off with Q-Posket. And what's cool about this little thing is I set up a sweet little array of things to unbox or at least to just show you some of it's going to be unboxing so we got ron weasley q posket finally got him in i got two other q poskets on the way i got spider-man oh that one looks sweet peter parker spider-man and a disney q posket so i'm gonna keep that one a surprise for you guys that disney one's coming in today um, but I'm going to wait till I get the Spider-Man one in so I can unbox both. So I'm excited about that. All right. So this is how the Q-Poskets come in. They, this is a very normal thing. If you've seen Q-Poskets before, I've definitely done some Q-Poskets videos. So we got the stand. We got Ron's head. I'm telling you, these things are super adorable, man. Really cute. We got his body, and then if he has an accessory, which he does, that's his accessory. We will unaccessorize him or unopen it to give him. So that's just his body. He's just like, "Hey, I'm Ron. Where's my head at? Headless red. Headless red. <laughs> He's got red hair, um, or orange, or whatever." Headless Ned is what I was thinking of. So, oh man, okay. <laughs> Sorry about that, but his hand and his broken wand that he taped together. They t they're they're pulling from. All right. So sorry about that. When I see the. The system running slow, like the internet and stuff, I gotta slow down. So, it's like when you used to put tape in the middle of your glasses when it broke. So he did the same thing. They're pulling from that for the wand here. I'm gonna put it against my black shirt. Because over there you might not see it as much. And it's still not showing up. But hopefully it will once we get them all set up here. So, I'm gonna put his wand and his hand together. Put them down on his stand. I'm gonna have to. These things are so cool. Um, in case you're wondering, the price point on these are, if you buy them new in the store and you don't have to go online and get them, you can get them for $24.99. That's the normal store price. So um, sometimes um, you have to get them online, and then it's whatever wherever you go, whatever they're charging for these things. So there is Ron Weasley. He's all set. Once he's put together like this. Look at that sweater. That sweater looks so real on him, right? I'm telling you the details on these things are amazing. So let's see if I can do that. How can I hold Ron? There we go. There's his broken wand. His sweater. His shirt coming down from the sweater. His pants. So... That is Ron Weasley. And what's nice is that right here, I got Draco, Harry, Hermione, and then boom. There's a place right for Ron, Ron to go. I can't even speak. <laughs> Alright. Guys, I have, I'm telling you right now, this pop is so hard to find. Um, and I had to drive one hour, like a little over an hour, like an hour and ten minutes to go get this bad boy. Um, you cannot see it through the pop protector, but it comes like that. Look, it comes wrapped in a pop protector. That's how you buy it at Target. I'm sure a lot of you that have them, you obviously know that, but some people that don't, maybe you don't know that, but, um, it comes in its own pop protector and it's sealed shut. So I don't know. I, th I mean, I can see him good here. It's just unfortunately you can't see him that great with the glare. I really don't want to open all this up and take him out of the box. This is like, 
These are so hard to find. And I know this is easily, and I'm telling you, man, like, I promise you, this is easily, very easily a $100 pop. Um, it, it's probably going to go up there. Um, I don't know how many they made, though. We all know that Funko loves to make Star Wars pops. They make way too many of them. But how many did they make of these? So that's going to really determine, are they going to do a second drop, a third drop, a fourth drop? Is it? I don't know. Um, but I'm worried because we never know how many they made. So I'm worried in the fact that I hope they don't like re-release it and then it's like accessible, like easily accessible because then the price just drops. But it's going to be easily a $100 pop. Depending on how many they made, it could go up to $200. Um, I definitely see that as a potential, as a possibility. Really depends on what, I mean, not what, how many they made. So here we have um, Big Time Spider Man with the stealth suit. Um, he doesn't look too stealthy when you put neon green on him. So I don't, I mean, obviously. He's not trying to be stealthy because you can't. But they're playing off of the um, the colors on like a like a frog, like a poisonous frog that um, that beautiful green, like venom. You know what I mean? So really cool, big time Spider Man. Um, I love this damn Marvel Legend. This thing is sick. Um, and there's the back of it too. I don't open these up. That's so badass. Guys, you have to pick this up. I got it at GameStop. Um, you gotta snatch it up when it drops. Well, it's already dropped. But if you don't have it in your area, you gotta snatch it up. These last two were unboxing. So I went to Think Geek on the weekend. They actually had $10 for these pop and a t-shirt boxes. 10 bucks. that's it. I never picked up Superman. Um, always wanted to, but I saw the other boxes sitting around, so I knew it wasn't in, like, immediate, like, emergency that I go pick it up when it dropped. Um, I did pick up other ones when they dropped, but I'm not gonna lie, like, Superman is not one of my favorite characters. I don't dislike him at all. I actually like him a lot, but I like all the other ones before him. I like Wonder Woman more than him, um... Actually, Batman's my favorite in DC. Wonder Woman's my second favorite. Like, I am a huge Wonder Woman fan. I have posters of Wonder Woman, as you've probably seen if you know me. I got all my Wonder Woman pops here that go three deep. There's quite a few Wonder Woman. Might actually do a video showing you all my Wonder Woman pops. Um, but this this character wasn't... I was going to always buy it, but this character wasn't... Um, He's never really touched me and like emotionally like a lot of the characters do to where you just want to buy it immediately. So I could hold off on him. I'm glad I did. He was only 10 bucks, which is pretty damn good for a Jim Lee pop and a t-shirt. 10 bucks. Great deal. They had all of them on sale, by the way. All the black and white pops with tees for 10 bucks. That is amazing. So there is Superman with his cape flowing. He looks sick. The, the, the traditional. Damn. I need to get my coffee going. The traditional little strand of hair coming down on his forehead. Um, just absolutely looks amazing here. Look at that cape. Look at his cape flowing in the wind. Like the wind's pushing it. Oh, he just looks so cool with this hands and a fist. This is a great looking pop. And that is the comic book uh, Superman that they're going for from Jim Lee. Really cool pop. I'm glad to put it in my collection. I have every Jim Lee pop. And uh, now I got that one. Superman T. Looks amazing. Put that on the side. Alright. Last thing for the video, guys. We're going to unbox this bad boy. The Day of the Dead. Get a closer look at Jack Skellington. At least his head. And this is at Hot Topic. It's a Hot Topic exclusive. I don't know if I showed that. I think I did, yeah. Hot Top Exclusive. And we're going to take him out just to kind of get a closer look. We're going to do a 360. There's some artwork on the back of his head. So I want to show that to you. And uh, that will wrap up the video. If you guys haven't subscribed to the channel, if you're new to the channel, welcome. Um, if you haven't subscribed and you like the content, hit the subscription button. Um, I'm on the road to 1700 trying to get there. So 
you guys can help me out hit the subscription button and uh, if you like any of these hit the th thumbs up button let me know um, and hit the bell for notifications if you want to be notified when I drop another video so here is let me see is that nostril oh wow so there's a real holes in his nose it's not just blacked out you can actually like pick his nose for him that's pretty interesting so we're gonna start with the top I'm gonna just cover him real quick going over the detail you got zero there on the side and you see how they did that stitching there how they that's really cool this thing is awesome really cool all right we're gonna get to the back side of them and that's the top part comes down and you got zero again so you got zeros all over them <laughs> um, really cool Jack Skellington head sculpt day of the dead looks absolutely amazing so guys that wraps up the video thank you everyone for watching please be kind to one another treat everybody with respect and show love spread love and positivity in your own personal life do something today that makes a difference for somebody else put a smile on somebody's face today that's my challenge to you i'll see you guys on the next video take care everybody enjoy the rest of your day